It was Thursday. I was in my office preparing to call it a day. I had just finished a case about what I thought was a missing person. Long story short, it wasn't a who, but a what. Just when I was about to lock up and leave the office, the phone rang. Normally, I would have let it ring as I left, but something in my gut told me to take the call. Hello? Agents missing! Metrics falling! No occupancy! Find coaches! Where, where is this? Concentrics! Concentrics? The name alone got my attention. As I put the phone down, there was a knock on my door. I hurried over to see who it was, but when I opened the door, there was no one there. I glanced down and found a small envelope with something written on it. I picked it up to read what was written on it. It read, something to get you started. I opened the envelope to reveal a strange card and a letter. The letter read, Detective Delve, this card can open many of the doors at Concentrics. Use it carefully. There's only 500 credits in it right now. Each of the doors uses a different amount. If you get stuck in a room, no one can help you. Before you put it away, make sure to sign the next page. It's a non-disclosure agreement. I picked up the phone again to call home. Don't wait up, I said. This is going to be a long night. I didn't have to think twice about flagging down a cab and headed straight for Concentrics. On my way there, I couldn't help but think about that call. Here I go again, I thought, jumping into another case like a mouse in a block of cheese. I couldn't tell if it was a trap. Outside the building, I called my trusty informant from the office, Logan. He was the best person to ask about what was going on, and my go-to guy for vague messages. If I wanted specifics, I always had to show him my badge. What a corporate guy. Hey, uh... I can't stay for very long. It's it's crazy in there. The big bosses, uh, they're all grumbling among themselves about saving CSAT and increasing occupancy. They started bringing in new guys today, but they're not taking calls. They call themselves coaches. Want me to show you where you can start digging for clues? Here, swipe your badge here, and we can get going. I only knew about half of what he was telling me. What were metrics? What was CSAT? What did occupancy and attendance have to do with agents disappearing? What could coaches do in a call center? The truth is, I'm, I'm glad to get away from that chaos. You have no idea how many calls are coming in, and uh, out here, well, I get to talk to you. Hmm. Maybe it's not so bad inside after all. Well, I think I'll hang around for a few more minutes. Let's see how Triple D, Detective Danny Delve, is going to handle this case.